Hey guys, Jen Banks with Banks Canine Solutions, and in this video I am going to show you how to teach your dog to allow you to brush their teeth. I've been dealing with some, some dental problems with Bamba lately. He already knows how to have his teeth brushed, but I'm teaching Moon Pie how to um, accept tooth brushing so that I don't have the same problems with her as she ages. Um, so all of this information is coming directly from a dental consult that I had for Bamba at uh, the Veterinary Dental Services in Boxborough, Mass. Uh, I just went there two weeks ago and they shared this information with me and I'm going to share it with you. Um, so Moon Pie has never accepted her or, or never really had her teeth brushed before, but I have handled her muzzle a lot. So she's pretty comfortable with me grabbing her muzzle and lifting up her lips and opening her mouth as well. So before you really dive into toothbrushing, you should make sure that you're, you're able to handle your dog that way. And I do have a separate video for that. I can link to that. Um, and then the next step is just getting her comfortable with the toothbrush. So I have a dog toothbrush here, and it is um, triangle shaped, just to um, properly get around the, the shape of the dog's tooth. They're a lot different than ours. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put, usually I would put toothpaste on the end and pretty much just let, let the dog lick the toothpaste off. Uh, and I am using dog toothpaste. So this is what I bought. Let's see if it gets in there. This is what I bought from um, the dog dentist in Boxborough. It is Verbac CET uh, and it is beef flavored. You very specifically want to use dog toothpaste, not human toothpaste, because they swallow it. Uh, and if they swallow human toothpaste, they will get sick. Um, Moon Pie doesn't like the flavor of this, so I am using peanut butter to start. And it is labeled dog so that no one in the house eats it on accident. But basically what I'm doing is dipping the toothbrush um, getting some, some peanut butter on the toothbrush. And what I started with is just pretty much letting her lick it off. And chewing is fine. If she kind of chews on the brush, that's fine. If she's breaking it, take it away. Um, but we, that act of chewing is going to help uh, ultimately brush the teeth. And when you are brushing the teeth, eventually what we want to do is I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get back here. So I've done this with her a few times. And after she's after your dog is comfortable with the toothbrush, um, what you can start to do, Moon Pie, good girl, is you can stop your dog from moving so much, and you can kind of slip it under their cheek, and then just kind of let them chew on it. Yeah. And I'm not being very productive at this stage. My The only thing I really want to do at this stage um, is get her comfortable with me putting the toothbrush in her mouth. So I'm not doing a whole lot of brushing. I will be um, probably soon because she's already a lot better at it than she was when I first started. When I first started putting the toothbrush in her um, in her mouth, she was really upset about it. So I might do a little bit of just kind of scrubbing and then let her eat at it. All right. So what you're the point of um, toothbrushing here is is just to get get at the gum line and scrape away any sort of gunk you see there. Eventually I want to do the whole mouth, um, the back teeth, good girl, <laughs> the back teeth, the front teeth, the canines, as well as inside the mouth as well. I'm not doing that at this stage. Out. You cannot have the toothbrush. <laughs> at this stage I just want it to be a good experience. And you can use treats as well. So it's not like humans where once we brush our teeth we're not supposed to eat. Um, with the dog, you can feed them right away. It's not a big deal. And I might just, good girl, I might do the other side. Let me swap her around. Come Hey. Come here. <clears throat> no, don't eat out of the jar. Come here. Good girl. Relax, relax. Good girl. And then stick it in there. <laughs> good girl. <laughs> Girl. And then I'm going to ask for some stillness. So she just did a whole bunch of chewing, which is fine because she's at least not shying away. But now I want her to be still for a second. Brush, brush, brush. Stop. And brush the fronts really quickly too. Hey. <laughs> 
Good girl. There you go. Oh, Bamba's next. So that's all I'm going to do with her for now. Place. Good. Um, and probably I'll stop using peanut butter soon because what's happening now is she's so excited about the peanut butter that she keeps trying to bite the brush. So in the next video that I do with her, I'll actually be using the dog toothpaste, which she's just, she's not as crazy about the flavor. Maybe if I try it again, it won't be so bad. <clears throat> so I brushed Bamba's teeth quite a few times, so this is not a new thing for him. Um, I am also using the toothpaste, which is oozing all over the place right now, because he, he doesn't mind the taste of it at the, at the uh, dog dentist. They let him sample it before uh, having me buy it, so I knew that he liked the taste of it. Bomb, come here, bud. Bye, boy. Can you come a little closer? Good boy. Come here. Good. Can you move your bum this way? boy. So, to do this, again, he's pretty good at it. I'm going to take the toothbrush and pretty much stick it in his cheek. Good boy. Good. And I'll get the canines also, and I want to get, um, the bottom teeth, good boy bud, and the bottom canine. Yuck. Brushing dog teeth is gross. And I'll get the fronts as well. Good boy. No. And then, no, go. Down. And then I gotta do the other side. Bamba. Got a boy. Sit. So again, I put more toothpaste on it, um, and I'm gonna reach back in um, and get the back molars, the outside of the back molars. A little bit of chewing is good. He's really nice about how he chews without like actually trying to take it from me like she was. That's that's kind of what I'm um, looking to get with Moon Pie eventually. Good job, bud. And then I have to do the inside of the teeth as well which this is new for Bamba because when I first taught him how to brush his teeth, I didn't realize you had to actually brush, brush the inside of the teeth as well. So what you're supposed to do, <clears throat> Bamba, come here, sit, good. Um, let's see here. You're supposed to actually stick the toothbrush inside their mouth like this. Good boy. So this I'm just keeping really short with him because it's new and as you can see he does not like it. Um, so that's where I'm using my treats for him. And then I might do that again. Let me see. Good boy. So just very little bits of brushing um, followed by a treat and then over time I'll do it for a little bit longer until I'm able to get all the teeth. You want to finish that? Good boy. Do you want that? <laughs> All right, you guys, I hope this helps you brush your dog's teeth. Um, dog uh, gum health especially um, becomes a big problem as the dog gets older. It's part of what I'm dealing with with Bamba. He just had his teeth cleaned um, and his, his gums were really dirty. He's only four years old and they definitely shouldn't have been that dirty. Um, but they do need their teeth to uh, be taken care of just to avoid infection and whatnot. Um, and his breath is much better ever since, uh, ever since having his teeth cleaned. There you go. Good boy. That was a nice one. I hope you found this helpful. Bye, guys.